today we're going on an adventure um, to the, to, into the ocean just because we can. And I gotta show you some of the boats you can get. I don't have a battleship, but <clears throat> let me turn this in. There, now maybe the <coughs> in-game noises won't be as loud. Okay, and it's, this is going to be a long adventure, so I'm not going to make you watch the whole thing, but um, this is the fast boat, and it'll also carry packs, and I may die in this adventure because there's reds out there, but we'll see. So let's do this. This is the speedboat. People can hang on the sides, on those bars on the sides. Um, if they don't all fit in the boat, it'll carry three passengers. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then it has these things it can do. This is the fast speed, and that's a uh, you know, hurricane or zonal. It uses fuel to do that. I can open the trunk, the hood. You see there, you can put four packs in there, which is nice when you're pulling up treasures. And then if you're traveling at night, it has headlights. Okay, I'll, sh I'll show you a few more boats before we get to where we're going. This is the first, well, there's a rowboat. It's the first boat you get, and it is just that, a rowboat. So I didn't bring it to show you. This is um, the first actual boat that you get that goes any that does anything. I mean, it goes, you know. And it goes pretty good. We used these for a long time. I believe this one is equipped with a harpoon. So I could harp, so I could harpoon um, things. So what people used to do <laughs> what people used to do is, uh, if you were loading a a ship up on the shore in a safe zone where they couldn't get your cargo. They'd get out a bunch of these boats with har these little things with harpoons and um, harpoon the big ship and pull it out to the to the danger zone, and then they could um, kill the kill the owners and steal the boat and uh, you know just fun stuff like that. <laughs> I don't know how much of that gets done anymore, but it used to. Okay, so let me show you it goes. That's its fast. And that's another fast. And then this is the jet propulsion. <laughs> that gets you hopefully away from somebody who's trying to fly out from the shore and land on your little boat. Because out here they could do that and kill me. Then they could steal my boat. Or You can put, I believe you can put pack carriers on this, but never did. Okay, that's that one.
This one is the schooner. This is used for hauling packs. And it does not go very fast. <laughs> um, but you can see it has the ability to haul packs. So if you if you're gonna pull a ship up, sunken ship up, you want to have one of these to put all the packs on. Or if you're gonna haul packs across the ocean, this is your because you if you can make a, all the way across with nobody killing you and stealing everything, you can make good gold. Um, there's you know the risk of being killed, but hey, there you go. And this one just has the normal fast. Actually, for a quick turn, if I was turning, it would do it quickly. But I'm not skilled at any of this. So. Anyway, there's my schooner. I mean, my merchant ship. Not my schooner. Okay, and this next one was just a fun... <laughs> one year they gave us these for fun. And we have had more fun with these. Now, oh, I got in the passenger seat, I believe. No. Um, this will carry one passenger. <laughs> and uh, we, used to, we used to get on these and try to paddle down rivers. And I think if you're sitting in the passenger seat, you can throw uh, pedals up in the air. Isn't he cute? <laughs> anyway, they're just they're they're just a lot of fun. So um, we would take them out and have fun with them every once in a while. So that's all the, the boats I I have. Um, and I forgot to show you one thing that this boat does, but I had to be out. You have to be in deep water to do this, but... Okay. Now you can get way too uh, intense with that and and it looks like you're going to flip backwards, but it doesn't. When it cools down, I'll show you that it um, it can really fly up in the air. Which I don't do if I can help it, because it's like a total... I, I, I think it slows you down. Uh, maybe I, I could be wrong. I never tested it, but I think it slows you down. Ah. <laughs> oh. So that's <laughs> that's uh, its major trick. If somebody jumps on your boat, you can do that and f fling them off. They can fling off. So I will uh, get to where I'm going and then and then come back to you. So. I'm at Friedrich Island, and I forgot that I have this boat. I've never used this boat, um, but it's a fishing fishing boat. If you like to go fishing out in the ocean, that's what this boat is for. So I thought I'd take it out and show you before I got to the island. Um, in front of me, well, you might not be able to see them, but... There's a school of fish. Those aren't the ones you fish for, but they're just cool looking. Swimming around out there in the ocean. Let's see if this one will go faster. I'm sure he does.
Well, that was pretty cool. <laughs> okay, now, when you're out in the ocean, if you run into land, it will damage your boat. So, if I get to the point where my boat is being damaged, and then I go to send it away, you have a good chance of destroying it altogether. So you generally want to send your boat away before you get too close to the land. I'll turn. Checking here to see if um, this guy is. Oh, I'm going to get killed. There's probably reds here. I'm checking to see if this guy is up who um, I need to kill. And I don't think I can because I think he's too powerful. But I have a quest where I have to kill him. And it looks like there may be people here, so I may die. Come on. Nobody's here. But neither is the guy that I have to kill. He's never up when I'm here. I don't know what time he gets here. But, um... I'm supposed to kill him. This is where I come to get a lot of um, black pearls. I I dive here a lot to get um, pearls. Okay, so I'm going to take you to another place that's fun. Well, I mean, it isn't always fun, but it ha it's fun for me. But um, there's a, a whole um, event that goes on out here, and um, the ships fight each other and, and everything because you can get this really cool um, cargo that brings a lot of gold, like a hundred gold each or something, but um, until, before you can go get it, you have to kill this big um, octopus thing, squid or whatever it is, and it's fun, but it's, and it's a cool sh ship wars that everybody shoots each other, your ship goes sinks it. it and this and the water out there is deadly so if you land in the, if you if your ship gets destroyed and you land in the water then uh, you can die just from the water so you have to try to get up on on uh, one of the rocks or bring a boat out or something so that you don't just die in the water So it's quite an adventure, and I don't know if they even do it anymore. Um, if they do, I'm going to try to get out on one of the ships and show you. I'll have to get some ammunition and stuff so that I can participate. But we used to do this every day. We'd come out and get involved in the battle, the battle of the ships. And they had galleons. Now, I haven't seen one in any of the places, and I'm wondering if you can even still get them. I don't know. But they're big ships that do cool things, and uh, and they were the hardest to, to kill, to knock out. So if you had a galleon, you lasted the longest in the war, that's for sure. Um any small ship would generally get killed right away because it has cannons, you know, you shoot cannonballs at each other. Totally cool. Okay, so this water probably at this point is uh, poisonous. That's why they call this the Sea of Graves. Okay, this is what I brought you for. See this thing? Now watch this. And if you're in battle, 
you try to avoid these because of this. <laughs> totally cool. <laughs> And sometimes it would take us and just really send us sky high. I mean, way up there. <laughs> anyway, that, that's the fun. That's the fun part of this area. <laughs> Water spigots. If I'd have been able to film. Back when we used to do this, we would have had some awesome shots of going up on some of those. You have to be careful because if you go up and then come back down and land on like this thing I'm going to here, um, you, you'd probably mash your boat all up. I mean, you know. And then sometimes your boat would come down and land on somebody else's boat, cause all sorts of damage. Everybody has to have plenty of shattered and scant sand to uh, repair the ships and stuff, but the octopus isn't here right now, but he would be hanging on to that statue right there if he was out here. And then you have all this um, water that's, uh, you know, dangerous water. And then everybody would battle, and as soon as you killed the octopus, which took a long time, then you'd go into that island right there, that place, and make a um, pack, or as many packs as you can get away with, try to get away without being killed by the, by the other team, um, so it, it was a lot of fun, and like I said, if, if they still do it, and I can get out here, I'll get out here and, and film it so that you can see how awesome it is. It's the only PvP I ever I ever got involved in that I loved. I'm hoping that I don't smash my boat so if I get in the water I'll All right, so that's um, what I wanted to show you here. And now I'm going to take you one other place that I'm not going to make you watch me try to get there. But um, you did miss a giant um, jellyfish that attacked me and the sea bugs, which always attack. And so I, I need to show you those. And uh, if I put it on pause, you won't see them, but oh well. I might be able to unpause it quick enough without dying. Because I can't do all these things at once. I don't have enough hands, unfortunately. This, and this place always is raining like this. Always. You can't come in here that you don't have weather. Kind of fun. Anyway, I will be back when I get to where I'm going. Okay, I'm, I'm being attacked by a jellyfish. You can sort of see him back there. See him? He'll kill my boat, so I have to be careful to see where my boat is. Oh, it's okay. Alright, I'm I'm taking us to um Growlgate Isle, which is Pirate Island. This is where the pirates can hang out. I don't know how many pirates we have in the game right now, and I'm probably going to die if there's a lot of them, because they'll be here. But, I thought I'd show you anyway. And if I die, I sacrifice my life for the cause. I used to come here too, and go um, searching for 
clams under the water, and they they never saw me down there, so I never got killed doing that. It was kind of amazing. You actually will get quests to do a few quests here, which is lots of fun when the red, when the pi pirates are here. Sometimes the pirates will be nice to you, but very seldom. What's that? Oh, a shark. There's a shark in front of me. Lots of sharks. Oh, dear. visible so that they can't see me if they're here. But I'll come out of invisibility just at time to get to them and they'll see me. Everything here can kill me, so I have to be careful because not only do the people that live here kill you, but all the other guys like that growling pirate over there can kill me. I'm going to see if I can find the... the um, yeah, here it is. This is what where you go if they kill you. Um, I can't get in there, but this it, it's a prison. So you come to life in there and you're trapped. And there's a a way to um, get untrapped if you jump up and do this thing. But um, it takes a while for you to figure it out because they don't tell you. Anyway, this is Pirate Island. There's a guy up there in that tower that you have to kill for one of your quests. And you generally have to fly up there from off of one of these mountains to, to be able to get up there. It's interesting. You could go up from the inside, I think, but there's so many things you have to kill in order to get up there that you'll um, definitely need help. If enough of you are here doing it, you could do it, but boy, it doesn't look like anybody's home. Which is okay, then I won't have to die, but...
Oh, I saw somebody. They'll kill you just for fun. They see you on their island, they'll kill you. See, you could go in here if you could kill all of these things and climb up to where the guy is, but there's a lot in there that you have to kill. Ooh, there's also some pirates in there. I'm gonna die. Okay, I think I'll take the cowards away out and leave here and <laughs> go home. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. See you the next time.